hello. Is it a full moon? Oh my. Like it's a full moon. Didn't lock the trap. It didn't? Is it's it locked good. now? This is <laughs> oh, it won't lock now with that sitting on the bed. Hi guys. Hello. Sorry, we're kind of like locking everything up. I don't know if you can see me, but I'm here. Hi. Lance is here. What's up, guys? Choo! So you guys asked for a night dive. Lance just got off work a little bit ago. We drove an hour to get over here. And we are out here night diving. Hi, Alan. Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Allison. So we did a subscriber only dive this morning. I know everyone's just gonna watch you get dressed. <laughs> um, Lance with a win. I know, no, he's in it. Um, it looks really nice out. It was like over an 8.0 today. If you guys have watched our dives before, we know you know we rank it from a one through 10. So 8.0 is really good. The waves are looking nice. Um, so we're hoping to head out in the water today. Hello, hi. <laughs> and. Um, what time is it here in Germany? It's 9.19. I'm not 100% sure of what time it is. I can check. Hold on. It is 9.19 p.m. here. So <laughs> we're 12 hours difference. Um, you did not miss it. We're just starting. We're just starting. Um, so Lance is getting his wetsuit on. We're going to get our gear on. We're pretty much ready to go. And we want to go hop in the water very quickly. Hi, Courtney. Um, so we are going to go on a night dive you guys um if you are new to the page we are going to get you guys underwater take yeah. you guys live streaming on a scuba dive i'm going to go ahead and set up the camera um if you guys don't know we have to start the live stream before we put the phone in an underwater case oh it's dark um <laughs> um okay there we go Try not to blind everyone. Um, so we do have to put the phone in an underwater case, you guys. Uh, that does include a little bit of jostling, and we do have to connect a lot of Wi-Fi wires in the process. So there's going to be about 60 seconds of a whole lot of jostling. I do have my calm mask tonight, so I will be able to talk to you while we're underwater, which is great. You guys get to hear me say, oh, my God, a whole bunch. Um, <laughs> hello. Yes, it is 9.20 p.m. here. You've got two divers tonight. We've got Lance. And me, Brittany. What's up, guys? <laughs> so we're gonna head out and do about a 60 to 70 minute underwater scuba dive with you guys. It's gonna be so fun. Yes, and we are at Mall up here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put the phone in the underwater case and I'll answer some more questions, you guys. Thank you. We'll be super safe. Oh, dude, is that late? Um, so what we have here, I'm gonna show them real quick, babe. Um, is our underwater case. This is what we put our phone in, so we're able to live stream with you guys. Um, the back is clear. Oh, is the red filter still on? No, take it off. Oh, sweet. The back is clear, so I can see your comments while we're down there. I do try to answer some questions. But talk about, yes, we are going to go diving, you guys. We're going to go scuba diving. We're going to live stream it. We've got a whole setup here to transfer internet to us while we're underwater. Um, and we are going to go down to about 35 feet, so super shallow. But, yeah, let's get the phone in the case, and we will continue on. So hold on just a second, you guys. Jostle, jostle. Remember, they can't hear us really while we are getting the phone in here. I just got into scuba diving. It's the best, isn't it? Yes, we are going to go scuba diving in the dark. Um, so the phone is now in the case, you guys. What we're going to do next is we're going to connect our Wi-Fi to the case. Again, there's just a little bit of jostling uh, while we're doing all this. The case is about $350. Great question. And I would love to hear some whales tonight, but that just depends on how close the whales are. So we're gonna, you can put that down. I'm gonna turn this light on. Oh geez, very bright. Um, and point this up. Is that right in your face? <laughs> Here, maybe if I turn it down. <laughs> no, oh, yeah. no, oh, no, you gotta do that. <laughs> Poor Lynn. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, yes, this is actually live. I am answering questions. Hello, hi Storm. Um, we have, we can dive up to, on a live stream, up to 120 feet. I'm so sorry, you guys, we have to before it it's a little bit of jostling.
<laughs> no, I agree, Maddie. We had to call the dive the other night. Try the last night dive we tried to do a couple of days ago, just because visibility was super, super low. But the waves were pretty big the other night. Um, if you're a surfer, they weren't big compared to surfing. Um, but for diving, they were kind of large. Hello, you have not missed anything yet. It's looking good. Um, mama. Yeah. Yeah, there's no filter. Um, okay, so we don't need the red filter at night, you guys. Um, this other thing Lance has right here is our receiver. So this is like a big speaker. It's how we're able to talk to you guys while we're underwater. Um, I do wear a full face communication mask, which is right here. So I will have this on. I'm able to talk about things. It does come out a little bit muffled um, while we're down there, but bear with us. Um, oh. Yay, I'm so happy. We love being your favorite live. Um, the whales are not gone. I'm really hoping we can hear some whales, you guys. They are still here, but again, it just depends on how close they are. Um, I liked that airplane pilot speaker demo he did. <laughs> uh, no, we want it kind of close, but not too close. Um, it is 12.24 a.m. in California. Um, Caleb says, Lance! Lance! We're going to light him up. <laughs> it's not over. We're just starting. Sweet and sassy. So we are just going to get underwater. Again, I'm behind the camera. Hello. <laughs> um... <laughs> Uh, what BCD do you use? We've got these guys are aqua lungs for right now, but we just bought a whole bunch of Scuba Pro equipment. So that'll all be in in the next, I don't know, week or two. So we're waiting on that. But for right now, we're running with aqua lung. The setup takes us anywhere from like 10 to 30 minutes, depending. You want to get your kit on? Are we ready? Yeah. Um, depending on how lazy we are. Like today, I was lazy and just making a video in the car. So that took 20 or 30 minutes. Um, <laughs> um, are you filming underwater? We are going to film underwater. We have an entire really cool setup here. We drag this buoy with us. It's got internet on here, a long cord to transfer internet down underwater to our phone, which is in an underwater case. Hey! <laughs> and everyone spells my name right. You guys are so sweet. Um, <laughs> So we are able to live stream directly underwater up to 120 feet. Tonight we're only going to be at 35 feet and this is Mala. So if you guys have dove with us before, um, thank you, Caleb. There's Caleb on here and he's being, I don't know, he's being so nice to both of us. <laughs> um, oh, we can't wait to come to Puerto Rico. Um, so the things we're hoping to see tonight, you guys, are always, I'm always looking for sharks on night dives. They're out actively hunting. We've seen quite a few on our live streams. And it's just so fun to see them out and swimming around. My favorite, favorite, favorite thing to film at night is hunting eels. Any kind of eel that's out hunting, um, especially if it catches prey. Um, we are going in. We, we are just about to go in. Um, we have gotten quite close to a whale. We've gotten close to whales on lives. They've come like right up to us on our live streams while we've been kayaking. Um, uh, yes, many of the night sea creatures are... Yes, yeah, many of the, uh, the sea creatures are attracted to the light at night is what Brittany was saying. I'm in Washington State. I've seen a few wolf eels. Oh, interesting. That's not, I'm going to have to Google that one. I'm not sure I've seen that. I'm going to help Brittany. You got it? I'm trying not to blind Brittany. trying to blind Brittany. What's the weirdest animal you've seen? Weirdest animal? That's a great question. That is a great question. Honestly, like... I mean, they're all very unique. Why doesn't Brittany wear a wetsuit? Brittany doesn't get cold. What is the weirdest animal we've seen? That's a really good question. I mean, a Spanish dancer is pretty weird. I've seen, I mean, the calorie shells look kind of cool. Yeah, I think it's the calorie shells and the snails out. Yeah, and the snails out. They and, look awesome. You guys have seen um, a couple of times on the left. Do you get scared of the unknown? Not really. We get more scared of the ocean <laughs> conditions. <laughs> Current is scarier. Yep, very true, Nicole. So, yeah, tonight, hopefully, we're going to head off into the deep over there can't see it now because it's all dark but we're gonna walk out a little ways it is low tide from the looks of it so it's gonna be a fun walk in the dark over rocks <laughs> is there any of those punching shrimp I don't Not think here. yeah I don't think I've seen any here yeah we got cleaner shrimp 
Uh, we need a hair hair video with your hair looks so soft, Brittany. Thank you. <laughs> uh, oh, I missed one of them. It's the Sorry, ocean. guys. It's the salty ocean. Uh, fireworm is kind of the weirdest animal, probably oh, close yeah, to. Oh yeah, uh, Do we have mantis shrimp? No. Keep in mind, our divers are very experienced and not scared, but tap to cheer them on anyway. Yeah, definitely. Now's the time to share it, guys. Okay. Uh, help spread the word. Help our algorithms right now. Sharing is caring. Is the, you know, you control all your life. Uh, and then tap that screen, right? If anything, all, again, all it does is it really helps kind of push the video out at night. So have you seen luminescent waves? You know, out here, I've actually seen some bioluminescence at night. Not much, but... Not the waves. Oh, not the waves, yeah, but I've seen some plants. I forgot to respond. I was playing dinos. Oh, I don't even remember what I wrote. Um, we will shut the lights off a couple of times tonight to show you how dark it is down there. But. Yeah, that's going to be exciting. So there's going to be times where we'll cut the lights and you can actually get a visual of how dark it really is. And I don't see a moon what at the moment. I got one in each pocket. Okay. Uh, it's a full moon. So. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it's a full moon tonight, I guess. <laughs> What does that have to do with it? Uh -huh. we, should, we should be alright. <laughs> I'll keep an eye out. Okay. Yeah, thanks so much for talking with us. Of course, that's the whole point of this. We want to interact while we're doing this. Is it dangerous at night? I mean, it could be just as dangerous during the day. Yeah. Right? <laughs> Give her a light. She has one. I've got a. She's gonna, we have multiple yeah. lights. Don't she, she's going to have two, actually. <laughs> Are you guys at the pier tonight? Yep, we're doing Mala tonight. Uh, it's a fun dive. Yep. Sita. Everyone was asking about Mama Sita. But we, have, we don't usually see her at night. She's really pregnant. So we yeah. Know yeah, Brittany was just saying, we don't usually see her at night. Uh, they're usually out hunting at night, and she's real pregnant. So we might get a glimpse of her. We got lucky one night we saw her. Um, hi from Michigan. Mala is my favorite location that y'all dive. Me too. Yeah, it, <laughs> it is actually my favorite too. It's okay, like, an, it's like an, I'm in an aquarium. It's nuts. <laughs> We get asked all the time if we're in an aquarium when yeah. we're diving. Do you take a torch in the water at nighttime? We do. We got lights going. So we're just going to get the rest of the gear kind of situated. I'm going to hand this back off to Brittany. Right. And then uh, we're going to start walking, guys. Down into the water. Aw, oh, thank you guys so much. <laughs> Who is Mama Sita? Great question. Uh, Mama Sita is our resident uh, white tip uh, six foot reef shark. And she is very pregnant. She is due any moment. We've been keeping an eye on her. We usually see her during the day here at this site. Um, I have not really seen her at night, but we'll keep an eye out for her because we haven't been here for a couple of days and everyone's been asking. So if we don't find her tonight, we'll definitely come back tomorrow. Um, <laughs> Kendra, I love you so much. Um, so we'll come back tomorrow during the day to look for her, but we just want to keep an eye on that belly and see if she's had her pups yet. She's our favorite shark. Super pregnant mama. Um, is this your job or your hobby? We would love for it to be our job. So <laughs> uh, right now it's not. Right now we just do these live streams for you guys. But, um, you know, all the follows help a ton. All the gifts and everything are getting us to that point where we don't necessarily hopefully have to work as much and we can just live stream with you guys underwater and adventure all the time that's the goal um i'd rather be putting in the effort to live stream and chill with you guys okay uh you got to walk in front of me <laughs> then everything what lady lance is doing the car dealership how many babies could she have two to four babies and her belly's pretty big so i'm guessing she's gonna have two or three uh, but it's a guess and you know unless we're there when she births, which I probably won't happen uh, <laughs> We won't we won't really <laughs> Alan <laughs> I fell already <laughs> Not even in the water <laughs> nice. Oh my god, that's rough getting up <laughs> Did you fall? I can't see. All right, wait, you gotta keep it. Oh no, falling on Alan, stop it. <laughs> if you guys don't know and you're new to the page, I fall a lot. <laughs> I am a professional, I'm pretty good underwater. Uh, <laughs> oh yes, not so good on land. Is it really deep? Uh, no, this is a very shallow dive. Oh my God, it's gorgeous. Oh, 
uh, very shallow dive, you guys. We'll be max depth of 35 feet. So we can live stream up to 120 feet though. Professional fuller. <laughs> um, because if we use headlamps, um, only what we are looking at directly is gonna be illuminated. So the reason we use torches is we're live streaming and we can direct where the light is. Um, I have a flashlight on the live stream. So everywhere you guys look uh, when you're diving with us is gonna be illuminated. And then I carry a torch. So while you guys are looking at something, I'm constantly looking around like this, and swiveling my head, but I can't do that with the camera. So I usually kind of point you guys in one direction and I'm actively looking around. Uh, water temp is 75 degrees. Woo. So yeah, if you guys, if I waved the camera around, like if I had the camera strapped to my head, you guys would get sick. <laughs> like, I am swinging my head around in every direction. I love it. I'm happy you're a professional faller too, but not that you broke your foot. Um, where can I donate? You guys are freaking awesome. Uh, TikTok gifts help our algorithms the most. Um, if you want to donate directly to us, we do have a Patreon and a GoFundMe up. So it's all just kind of getting us to the point for better gear, to do better live streams underwater, and hopefully have more time with you guys. So we spend almost every free second when we're not working live streaming underwater dives currently. Uh, did, no, we're just starting. It didn't just end. It's just starting. Uh, we are in Hawaii. We did fix the mic. We used it. Oh, thank you so much. I love the boat. Uh, we used the con mask this morning and it worked wonderfully. So I will be able to talk to you guys tonight. Um, if you guys are new, Keep in mind, I'm underwater. I can talk to you, but it does sound a little muffled. So, <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. It's the best. I try to enunciate as best as possible. Yeah, we've got professional translators. <laughs> Calm mask is here. Whew. So what we're doing right now is a shore dive, you guys. We don't have a boat. So we essentially have to get in the water and walk to where it's deeper water. Low tide, so and it's low tide so it'll be a couple minutes you guys uh once we're in deeper water we'll descend with the camera with you all oh and sometimes our signal gets a little spotty right here by the pier once we get to the end of the pier it's much better but keep that in mind you guys i'm sorry it might get glitchy until we get to the end over there Whew. But if you guys are just joining us, we're going to take you scuba diving. Hi, Earl Carter. Hello. We do always clean up everything we see. We would never leave trash in the ocean. Uh, we are actually planning a huge Earth Day cleanup event uh, to go check out what Patty's doing on Oahu. Um, woo! And then working with some other companies that specialize in like ocean cleanups, especially uh, fishing trash. <laughs> thank you thank you it is very safe you guys it's just as safe as diving during the day <laughs> Lance you're underrated no I'm kidding <laughs> we are <laughs> did you get stung by many jellyfish I've never been stung by jellyfish no so hopefully I didn't just jinx myself oh my god um and why do we dive at night uh great question predators that we like to observe come out at night it is beautiful. Oh my God, it's so clear. Uh, and we like to watch them interact with their environment, uh, like sharks, octopus, squid, eels, the shell, the snails, the invertebrates come out. Um, so we like to, you know, look around for them and see if they're hunting. Whew. Uh, yeah, but this will be a 60 to 80 minute long dive. It really just depends on how long our air lasts, when we start to get chilly, and how conditions are out there. Um, I'm sorry, I'm missing so many questions. Are, am I afraid of any animals in the ocean? Turtles. No. <laughs> um, 
uh, have like recently developed like this thing where I don't want to be near turtles at night. They come at me because of my light, I think. Um, so, and we try really hard not to shine the light at them or disturb obviously any turtles ever, but sometimes we're just swimming along and there's a turtle. Oh, <laughs> I was like, there's a turtle? Of course, no, there's not yet. Um, and they follow the lights. Uh, like we mentioned earlier, a lot of nocturnal creatures are really attracted to light. Did you grab my fins? Do you want me to hold them? Can you tell us your scariest moment? Like our last night dive, when a gigantic turtle came at me. That was my scariest moment. Um, I've had a lot of surprise moments. We had a big giant monk seal uh, come up to us right beside me on one of our live streams. And those things are huge. And I, I was sure it was a big shark. Um, <laughs> so I saw it out of the corner of my eye. But nope, it was a really, really, really endangered monk seal, which was super cool. Woo, yeah, this is not super cheap. Um, I don't think, to, I mean, I'm sure if you bothered a turtle, it would bite you, but we don't, we try not to bother them, obviously. Um, but I've never been bit by a turtle. Um, they're very attracted to us. If we're wearing bright colors, if our hair's down, um, the lights. So we do show you what we can, but yeah, but we try to keep our distance. Woo! Okay, you guys, is there a timer you set on your watch to remind you of how much oxygen time you have left? Great question, Lance. You want to explain oxygen to them? Yeah. All right. So, yeah, oxygen, that's a good question. So, what we have is a, um, a gauge. Uh, it's called the dive computer and pressure gauge. On that gauge, it gives us a PSI reading. And right now, I got about 3,200 PSI. Yeah. So we got about 3,200 PSI. So we always want to come back with some air in the tank just in case anything, right, safety-wise. So we look at that gauge constantly. Discord is in bio, some chat, and has some all updates on the dive sub. You can have a with us. Yeah, so there's a lot of cool features that we're pushing out for our subscribers, and one of them's a, a Discord. Um, I'm going to hand this back to Brittany and get my phone on. Choo-choo! Have you lost items while going fishing or diving? Um, not we've lost really expensive items like once or twice like this receiver that costs like six hundred dollars um that's the thing that's beeping and that's how i talk to you guys or how you guys hear me when i talk to you is that receiver um so we've dropped one of those before i, I dropped my calm mask which is this thing one time in 300 feet of water yes kendra so i dropped this and i was like that's two thousand dollars right there gone but somebody saved it for me so that was cool um so we do have a discord i put a link up in our bio and that's just going to be a place for everybody who follows us to kind of chat whether it's to like ask questions about sea life that we see on a live or ask when the next dive is going to be or weather conditions um i don't know if the link's working or not in the bio but we did make the discord uh, and this is very safe when you guys are educated. Oh, this is my husband. Hi. This is Lance. You did not miss it. We're just getting all our stuff on. Um, <laughs> you did not miss anything. And Lance is here with us. He's very invested. He's the one who got me into diving. Um, yeah, and then our subscribers will be doing voice chats with us in Discord and stuff like that. So thank you guys so much. You're all so sweet. All your little gifts and everything. We're almost there, you guys. We're actually going to drop a little earlier tonight because it's so clear. Sorry, I keep blinding Lance. Um, so it is very clear right now. Um, I can see the bottom. Ooh. Tonight's dive is going to be awesome. I mean, the fact that it's clear over here by the pier is huge. Um, normally, it's pretty murky, like right here. But it's super nice right now. So we're just gonna kick out a little bit more. I'm gonna get my mask on and we'll descend. I'm sorry, thank you for your patience if you're just here for the water bit. Um, but this is a whole process. And since my phone is in an underwater case, thanks for looking. Um, since my phone is in an underwater case, we can't start the live in the water. It's gotta be done on shore. 
Uh, be safe, all of you. Thank you so much. And it is a full moon. I will show you guys the moon when we're underwater. It's a little cloudy tonight, but we should be able to see it. Thank you guys so much. Oh yeah, and if you guys could follow, that'd be cool. TikTok recognizes gifts and follows for our algorithms and we're cool, I think. Um, maybe it's a little dorky and nerdy, but that's okay. Um, thank you, Lance. Um, well, Brooklyn, hopefully we can help you with that. I think one of my favorite things in the entire world is the ocean at night. Sorry, I'm just having Lance check for jellyfish and stuff. <laughs> they come out sometimes more on the full moons, and I did not wear a full wetsuit. So. <laughs> we are live. Hello. You, I don't think that you should be a good sex swimmer. Trust yourself in the ocean. We are live. Um, but you do wear a floaty vest. <laughs> so there's that. Lauren sends sorry, thank you so much, Lauren. When we get underwater, I'll write you a message. Oh, shoot, I hit a rock. Huh? <laughs> Nothing? <laughs> I hit a piece of the pier. Uh, thank you so much, Lauren. Uh, when we get underwater, I will write you a message. Discord link will be fixed. Thank you so much, Alan. Yeah, we know it. I think it's not working because TikTok does not play well with Discord. So if you open it in a browser, it'll work, like your, your web browser. But if you try to go directly from TikTok to Discord, it doesn't let you. So <laughs> we are learning that and figuring out a way to fix it. We will dive in just a minute. Hold on, guys. How's it looking? Feels good. Feels really nice, actually. Feels really good. All right, I'm gonna get my mask on. Let's just go. Okay. You ready? All right, guys, let me get my mask on. Alan will be here tomorrow. Sorry, yeah. All right. All right, are you ready? Yeah, Brittany's gonna go ahead and get her mask. There it is. Bad boy. Trying not to blind her, so I'm not gonna put, put it right in her face, but you can kind of see nice little little image of her. <laughs> Copied the link and I was able to join. Fantastic. Yeah. We love it. Yeah, join the Discord. We want to make sure we're talking with you guys. Right now I'm going to go ahead and test the connection while Brittany's underwater or putting her mask on. So let me know how it goes. Looks like we're all good. Perfect. Thanks, guys. Appreciate the help on that. We're, so we're gonna go ahead and drop here momentarily. Yeah, let's go. You're good right here. Yeah. yeah. You wanna take this? I'm gonna go ahead and get the cord. Oh God, let's go. Thank <laughs> you. 
turn the turtle. They turn the light off. Sorry guys, I don't want to shock the turtle. Thank <laughs> you. 
which we is at Stephen is back.
oh, there's a bigger shark over there. Uh, maybe four or five foot.
the tall guy. It was really big. I hope she comes by. It was not a white cat, but it was about 15 feet away from us.
pretty pink inside. Oh, write your name when the lights are on.
not only do I have a light, but I'm super, super bright. So that monk seal is probably all, all about that. <laughs> but there were a lot of sharks out tonight. So many sharks. I've never seen that many sharks out here. We got great footage of a white tip hunting and even catching some food. We saw Mama Sita. Uh, saw a really big shark kind of off in the distance. Um, had the squid who inked us. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry I didn't get a better shot of the uh, monk seal. There's a flashlight on my camera. So when I pointed the camera at the seal, it got really, 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 really interested in us and started kind of coming at me in the light. So, and I couldn't shut off the light. Woo! But that squid was cool. I like how I spotted it and um, I proceeded to like come down and check us out and then it inked me, but it inked me when I wasn't looking. So it kind of like weirded me out for a second. I was looking around for that shark, uh, but the squid Oh, it kind of like weirded me out for a second. I was looking around for that shark. Uh, but the squid was super I wasn't answering. Can you walk in front of me? <laughs> I wasn't answering all of your questions. I'm normally a little bit more interactive, but there was a lot going on tonight. Uh, but we are very limited on where we can dive um, because we need good cell phone reception um because that's the kind of internet we're using that's on top of this buoy that we drag around with us is your internet through mobile or router mobile it's through a like a portable hotspot we are working on getting starlink up and going to have better quality internet and i don't know more dive sites oh okay <laughs> um it is mala where at mala that was a crazy dive! Ah! Um, but I'm really sorry that we... It's so cool that you can get Wi-Fi. We figured it out. I'm sorry I wasn't answering all your questions when we were actually down there. I wasn't reading a whole lot. I was super distracted. The current was really strong and just really pushing us around. Um, what? I know. I kept telling them. I'm like, I, I didn't even know if we were going to be able to do that dive. I am so so happy we stayed down what a crazy dive you guys um tiktok does take a couple of hours to like process the video the live stream we're doing right now so i probably won't be able to download it till tomorrow morning and then it takes a minute to upload it to youtube but i will have every lance will have everything up and ready on youtube for you tomorrow if you want to rewatch the whole dive this was absolutely crazy uh I didn't focus as much on the eels and the fish tonight. We just saw so... I, I, I didn't look for any eels. I was so invested in all the sharks. <laughs> so invested. I can't believe that monk seal came up to us. <laughs> I'm happy you like that. It came right up to me, Lance. <laughs> I saw that. And I had like no free hands or anything. So I was kind of just like, ah. <laughs> for sure. But they're not big waves. Look how beautiful it is though. Oh my god. So we're headed to our car. Yeah, it was super bright when we turned the light off. The, like, the moon was like, huge. I was like enjoying just like I don't know, <laughs> Thank you. No, I'm so happy we got to take you guys. Um we'll be live tomorrow. We'll probably just come to the same spot but during the day. <laughs> Oh, thank you for the wheel! You guys are so awesome! Uh, Lance, we're we've been in like the, the top 30s in the ranks. It's just, you guys are amazing. Pretty much since like the seal, maybe before the seal. Was it the seal that did it? <laughs> um, yeah, they saw it. Uh, keep in mind that monk seals are one of the most. She was so big. Oh my god. 34 at one time during it live. Oh, it got down to 29. You guys are so great. What's in the blue bag? Great question. That's a dry bag. That's our internet. Uh, so that cord is what we use to transfer internet down to the phone. 
but the blue bag is a dry bag and we keep our internet which is not waterproof um <laughs> in there and that's how we're able to live stream with you guys while we're down there um normally uh, it's a portable hot spot so not like a router it's a portable hot spot um we are for real we are for real was it the seal or was it the shark about the seal what shriek about the seal <laughs> it might have been the shriek <laughs> leave me underwater let's help <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> Oh, these animals, I'm just so bright. That's what it is. A lot of these animals just come right at me. <laughs> like, really, really close. Um, and then I round the corner, and of course, there's a turtle right after all that. Of course, I, like, round the corner and don't see it, and I turn my head, and, like, a foot away from it was so close to me. I'm like, oh, hello. <laughs> Got so murky. What is the mobile case you use? So I'm only using a Sea Life. Sports Pro case. It's rated up to 130 feet in depth. Fantastic, phenomenal case. Hands down, highly recommend. Um, they're about $350 for the case. Uh, you can buy them like anywhere on Amazon, dive shops. Um, but it has been a beast. We have taken this case on so many dives because we live stream all our dives. So it is really really taking a beating it's not cold you guys um the water is about 75 degrees and i would say the air is 78 degrees it's pretty late at night i think it's almost what time is it Kara? i think it's almost 11 o'clock uh, -huh. uh were you scared the first time i think i was really scared the first Time I dove I've definitely gotten like a very healthy respect for the ocean over the past few years of diving um, we always try to be as safe as possible um, and uh, really keep an eye on conditions and current I mean honestly you guys when you hear me screaming underwater I'm not really that scared if I were scared I would have like run off or something or tried to get away uh, I just get like really excited um, and I had a lot of stuff in my hands when that seal came around like I had no I was like clutching things to my chest so I was like trying to get Lance's attention and get him closer um, and even that big shark I was kind of yelling but that was an excitement thanks for all the gifts you guys um, so we don't live stream underwater for like six hours because I don't know where I would set that up. Uh, we don't have like private property and it would be really hard to get the live stream deep enough and leave it out there with the kind of currents that we have in Hawaii and the waves. So it's, that is actually a harder task than diving all around a dive site with you guys. Um, <sighs> 5 a.m. here, oh gosh. Um, every beach in Hawaii is public, so there are no private beaches, which is awesome. I love that, especially for like indigenous Kanaka Hawaiians. It's so great that that's a law. Um, <laughs> but I think there are places we can't dive. I think like a hee hee, maybe. I don't know. We have to ask Kara. Um, we're very limited on where we can live stream, so that's the downfall. We can only live stream where we have good service. Do you get cold? <laughs> Thank you guys. Thanks for making us do this. You guys are so awesome. This is all because of you. You all really wanted a night dive uh, after this morning's dive, and like we had the time, and Lance wanted to do it, so we uh, got out with you guys but thank you guys so 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 much it was absolutely incredible um we do get cold Lance was shivering when he was out there I did get a little chilly at the end there but not too bad the night dives are my favorite too <laughs> and we are going to dive tomorrow and we will be live streaming during the day tomorrow Alan flies in to see us tomorrow night so we're going to kind of hang out with him we aren't going to dive tomorrow night but um whoa 
So yeah, uh, he was saying Alan, one of our uh, amazing moderators, is uh, flying in tomorrow. Come hang out with us. So there's not going to be any diving uh, tomorrow night, but we're going to try to do some during the day. We just got to see how conditions are, see how people are feeling, uh, and then kind of go from there. I think we'll be able to dive tomorrow. Yeah, you did miss the dive. Sorry. It was so good, though. Hopefully, you get everyone had fun. Oh, I'm going to help Brittany lower oh, this. Got you got it? Okay. Yeah. All right, I laughed. We're about to get off. Oh, no. I will lie and say nothing good tonight. <laughs> oh, no. You guys, I am hands down going to say right now that that's probably one of the best dives I've ever been on. Um, visually, uh, image wise, like camera wise, you guys, like that was incredible. We got so many good, like photographic moments, but it was just so crazy. One of our favorite things to do is see animals hunting. So normally when we come across sharks, they swim away. They aren't a huge fan of like the lights um, and the noise we make. So it was just absolutely incredible to have some of these sharks be so confident, so brave, and just hanging out right where we were and hunting in front of us. That was so cool. Are the tanks heavy? Yes. Uh, this whole setup here is probably like 40 pounds plus maybe 35 or something, plus all the live streaming gear we carry all together it equates to about 50 to 60 pounds of weight per person um tomorrow we'll be diving tomorrow bella um if you guys aren't following us follow us we do pretty much only live scuba dives sometimes we go out and kayak and stuff like that um we spend a lot of time in the water with you guys and diving with you all uh it did just end i'm so so sorry you guys um we are actually leaving Hawaii in two months and we are going to take you guys around the world. We're going to live stream worldwide in different oceans and we're going to start off in the Yucatan area over in Central America. So we are not just going to be diving in Hawaii. I'm so sorry 808 Beater, we are done. You're definitely coming to Australia. Um, after we get to Mexico this summer we'll kind of be asking you guys a little bit more like hey where should we go what country do you want to see us in and stuff like that because uh, we don't have a specific plan we just want to dive a bunch um <laughs> are you native to hawaii no definitely not very holly hello uh i'm not native uh at all i've spent most of my life here in hawaii um i've pretty much grown up out here i don't even remember california which is where i was born um, but yeah, no, I am not, I'm from, I'm not from here, from here, I've, but I've lived out here about 25 ish years out of my 33 years of life. <laughs> so I call this my home. I don't know of another home. I haven't spent that much time anywhere else in the country or the world. Um, thank you so much, Tammy. Um, it was an incredible dive. You guys, like I'm still on a crazy dive high right now. Um, <laughs> That was by far one of the best dives I've ever been on in my life. I know. <laughs> I'm so happy we came out right now. Um, yeah, and thank you guys for all your follows and subscriptions. And hold on, let me get this out of the case. I'll tell you what time it is. And I don't have a light though on me. In a moment. All right, phone is out of the case. Oh, shoot, that went right. The light was bright. Um, it is 11.05 p.m., you guys. Um... So 11.05 p.m. out here in Hawaii. We still have like an hour drive to get home right now. This poor man has to work tomorrow. I want to dive with you guys tomorrow. Um, we do have a YouTube that we post all of our previous dives to. That's all we really post on that YouTube. Um, you can go check that out. There's a link in our bio for that. Um, if you guys want more updates on like what we're doing throughout the day, whether we're going to dive, what can conditions look like and stuff like that we have an instagram that we post a lot of stories on um it's 2 a.m in california you guys got that three hour difference um, <laughs> thanks for staying awake i know thanks guys you guys are so so awesome this was kind of a last minute dive i didn't really tell you all about it until like three hours before the dive but i promised everyone this morning that we were gonna dive um did lance tell you about the eel message i wrote you about no. Is this Kihei or Ma? This is Ma uh, Malapir. Lance <laughs> is so confused for a minute. We're really tired right now. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I'm missing so many questions. Ah. Uh, what's the Instagram? The Instagram is Maui Pose. It's the same handle as our TikTok. Um, and that's just, it's like the same content as our TikTok, but we post stories there. So the stories are kind of the big deal because Jake, Kara, Lance, and I kind of post throughout the day, like what we're doing, when the dives are going to be and stuff like that. Heather wants an eel emote. Oh, I got you, girl. We're getting oh, a manta yeah, yeah. emote, an eel it's emote. Like um, there's a couple emotes that I will have uploaded. I could probably do that tonight. Everyone's been asking for more emotes, though. It's not just you, girl. Yeah, <laughs> there's like, like 10 different people that have messaged me over the past. Lisa has been like begging for emotes for so long, so I have to get some up. <laughs> you guys, but we'll, we'll definitely get those up. I should just do it tonight so you can all use them tomorrow. Um... I still can't believe we saw that monk seal. I am ecstatic to go through our footage. So what's at the top of your bucket list of things you want to see diving? I think the number one thing on my list that I want to see while scuba diving. Um, so yeah, I think it would have to be either a tiger shark or a white shark. Um, I, I really know that we saw a larger shark tonight that was not shaped like a white tip um i'm gonna have to go through some pictures of sharks just it was far enough away for us to not get a good 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 look at it but it was not a white tip reef shark tonight so i need to go see check and see if and maybe it was a galapagos or something um it is not cold number one on my list is a humpback i have seen humpbacks underwater it's an incredible experience um i would love to see them again underwater um how long have we been diving? I've just been diving for a little over three years. We're pretty new at scuba diving, but in that three years, I probably have five or 600 dives under my belt. Um, <laughs> so, so lots of dives. We dive so much, especially with you guys. Uh, we have seen dolphins while scuba diving too, which is all, that's a really cool experience. Again, I'm really brightly colored. If you guys, I don't know if you saw me or not, but <laughs> yeah. So I'm really brightly colored and the animal, guys didn't notice tonight um they come right up to me uh <laughs> so but we're in maui hawaii you guys so whatever we have like seen dolphins and uh, monk seals obviously uh they come right over to me uh they're like what is this super fun bright happy thing and then i'm always like what is going on uh the squid tonight was so cool i'm so happy he inked us because that's gonna make for a really cool video <laughs> Um, we do run into octopus all the time. They're called tacos out here in Hawaii. Taco with a K. It's actually a word, but that's what the locals call them out here. Um, there are two different kinds of octopus we see. There's the day octopus and the night octopus, the hei or, or um, ornate octopus. Um, the day octopus is extremely shy. Uh, when we see it, it's usually hiding in the coral, um, and we try not to bother them too much. Uh, we'll like show the camera on it for a minute, but again, we're not going to try to like grab them or harass them in any way. Uh, and then the ornate octopus that we see at night is a little bit more aggressive. Uh, they're very confident little creatures, so we see them way more. Um, yeah, everything's more good. Everything's a little more confident at night. Thank you so much, Courtney. Um, <laughs> thank you guys so much. But this was just a crazy dive. Why is she mentioning dolphins? Because we have seen dolphins while diving before. Um, I've only seen them while scuba diving on the big island of Hawaii, not out here in Maui. I've only seen dolphins while I've been kayaking. Um, we saw a lot of sharks. I have to go through and rewatch the video because I don't know how many different sharks we saw. I can guarantee you as at least three different sharks tonight, probably four or five. Um, a couple of, yeah, I saw a lot of sharks tonight. Um, I know on camera, we probably saw four or five different sharks, but there were a lot of sharks. I kept pointing my camera out and saying shark, but I don't even think you guys could see them. Yeah with the way visibility was. Um, yes, so we'll be back here tomorrow, Nats. We really wanna look for Mamacita during the day. I wanna get a good look at her while she's resting. We did see her tonight. She is pregnant. Um, I mean, I, I'm a Maui fan. That's why I live here. Um, if you ever find a Meg, you gotta get, uh, if we find a Meg, I'll just be like hard screaming. You know me, oh my God. <laughs> so. 
Um, thanks for sharing. Yes, she's still Prego's Rasta. Uh, I could definitely see the protrusion in her belly. Lance saw her belly and that's what he was pointing out to me. Um, he was like waving his light around and then made the pregnant motion. I'm like, yeah, it is Mama Sita. Um, I do not surf at all. I like being under the water. Do you like Molokini or Lanai for scuba more? Um, I've been to both. I really like back wall Molokini because I've seen a lot of really cool stuff over there, but Lanai's reef is absolutely, it's really gorgeous. So I don't know if you're a reef, like Vista type person, Lanai is beautiful. Uh, if you're a big animal type person, uh, Molokini, you're more likely to see the big animals. No, the Megs, the Megs are extinct. <laughs> I was just joking. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry not to like confuse everyone. Um, does anyone know if they went diving ALR? What is ALR? Already? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yep. We did go diving already. I'm sorry, guys. If you missed it, I'm super sorry because it was really great. It was. Like so great. So many sharks we saw. Oh my god. Uh, at least three different sharks. It felt like no, at least. No, there's more than that. Well, I'm, I mean, we've seen a ton of sharks. We probably oh. saw two different kinds of sharks. Yeah. Oh yeah. Right. Um, I, I've got it on films, but it's going to be in the distance. Right. But I want to go t look at the shape of it. We saw sea turtles, green sea the turtles. Monk seal. And we saw a monk seal. So that was amazing. Oh my gosh, the eyes on that monk seal were like, dude, I just captivated me. They were so big. Oh, I'm happy you were all about that. Lance. They were so just big. Me. I didn't leave you. I'm just kidding. He, he was just like coming right down at me. And I was like, excuse me, sir. Yeah. <laughs> and he was like, whoa, what, what we got going on? Oh, you're not food. Never mind. <laughs> and then it took off. <laughs> That's funny. It was huge. It was really, really big, you guys. And it, I mean, it had to, it was a cup. It was. Really yeah. Oh, yeah. And the squid that inked brick. You got it. <laughs> what time is it for them? Uh, I can't I see. I think it's like almost 1130. We can't see the time. Um, we did the update on the new iPhone 14. And. Like before on our live streams, I could see the time in the top left hand corner and now I can't. Yeah. So I guess I have to download like a widget or something. It's very inconvenient when people ask what time it is and I can't tell what time it is. I know, I can't wait uh, to watch the replay. I'll try to put it, put in a, 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 what do you call it? A timestamp on YouTube. I've never done it before, but. You guys, that was an incredible dive. I am. It's 11.14. Oh, it's 11.14. Oh, 11.14. I'm still freaking out. Um, They're so see. cute. Oh my gosh. Let's give everybody a, a shout okay. out to Brittany right here, your, your camera person today. And, and your person screaming. Yep. And, <laughs> and your commentator. Let's give every, give her a shout out. Very yeah. enthusiastic, you guys. I'm so sorry. I probably scared so many people on the live tonight with my screaming. We were it, silent. It was so quiet. I hadn't said anything for a minute. And all of a sudden I hit the button. I screamed like at the top of my lungs, big uh, shark. Uh, everyone's like, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> And then for everybody at home right now, please give yourselves a pat on the back. Thank you so much for getting us. I mean, we're number 43 right now in the daily Still, rankings. That is amazing. Biggest thing to you guys that we don't give enough attention to is our moderators. Um, we have insane moderators on this page. The most incredible moderators. Uh, Jake and Kara are usually out here diving with us, but they were uh, modding tonight along with Alan, Allison, Nicole, Kendra. And then we have Jody and Lisa that are on a lot as well. And they really keep the peace on the page, answer a lot of questions. And they really had to work hard tonight because I was not looking at all the comments. So give them like so much love. I was so distracted, like looking for animals tonight. Normally I'm a little more responsive. Um, so they had to work really hard to let you guys know like what we were seeing, what we're looking for, what's going on um, and to get my attention for certain things. So yes, our mods are amazing. Yeah, Maz, they're that brave. You can tell I'm like old because I'm just over here like. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, no, we have incredible mods. You yeah, guys. current current was really strong out there. Yeah, I told everyone <laughs> so many times. We're like we're like swimming sideways. I honestly almost <laughs> called that because it was like murky. When oh we got man, down, and the I saw you. I was like yeah. shoving us, and I'm like, I don't know. If I, I know you're that. like, where do we go? Yeah, I was, I was like, really concerned worry. about that, but then we it got better when we got out into deeper water but still that current was brutal is there a mosquito on me no brutal current um yes so it was a lot but i'm so happy we stayed out because like that dive was do you ever do yeah. lakes well we no not yet we hopefully. are we're planning on it hopefully. my sister really wants us to go check out where is it guatemala ecuador right 
Uh, and I think you're right, Guatemala. Guatemala. Um, there's this lake she stayed at with like a sunken city. I think it's Lake Adelan. Lake Adelan. Uh, Atilan. I have to look it up. Yeah. Uh, and she wants us to go there. So we would love to be like there for a little bit, live streaming there and stuff like that. It's a volcano crater lake. It's cool. Uh, so we'll see. We're going to start traveling the world, you guys. And like, we're just going to dive everywhere we possibly can. Um, yes. All yeah. right. All right let's but we got to go, you guys. We still have like an hour to drive home. My awesome husband um, has to work tomorrow morning. I want to get out and dive with you guys. So we are going to drive this hour home. We still have to clean all of this gear that's in here um, and get it ready for tomorrow and shower and get to bed. So we've got a lot to do tonight, but Lance champed it. He got off work, let me take a quick nap and he fed our children and got them dinner. And then we popped right back in the car and came out diving. Yep. So he crushed it with the whole diving this morning with us working all day, coming out here till almost midnight, diving with us tonight. Um. I love you too. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'd hang out. But yes, yeah, so if you missed the live, definitely on our, our YouTube channel, check it out uh, at some point tomorrow. It's going to get uploaded. And we'll be back um, tomorrow. Yeah. So <laughs> make sure to follow now. If you don't follow, follow now. Turn yeah, on those notifications. Lose us forever. <laughs> <laughs> we might pop up on your <laughs> FYP. Hi guys. Um, <laughs> well, we'll be live tomorrow. Uh, the conditions have been great for about two weeks now, so we hopefully we'll just keep it up with this good weather, and we'll be able to get dives in every day here on throughout the week. Heck yeah! Um, and hopefully some more night dives too. So yeah. Boom. Um, what was that? I was just zooming in on you. Oh, on what? On your face. No. <laughs> it always looks like you're zooming in on my boobs. I'm not. Like you're holding <laughs> the camera and I'm like, what are you doing? Uh, everyone says cute leggings. <laughs> Thank you. Do the kids dive? Uh, not yet, but they are practicing. Juliet will be able, my oldest, um, she'll be able to officially like dive via Patty, I think in like eight months or something. So she's getting like pool certified. So yeah. <laughs> can I get the work to take care of your kids so it can do more videos? What? Yes. Take care of the kids so we can do more. No, just <laughs> What's no, the channel kids. called? It's Come Dive With Us, uh, Maui, Maui Pose. Pose. So, by the way, if you haven't seen Brandy's chat, that's our logo. <laughs> oh, and I have legendary shakas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, sh show them how your, uh, your whale can swim. Oh, that's funny. Uh, but we also have a link in our bio here on TikTok for the YouTube. So if you don't want to like type it in and search for it, if you just click our TikTok page and click that little linky thing, it's the first first link up there. So Boom. it'll take you right to our YouTube and you can rewatch all the past dives you guys want. And then on top of it, if you want to just see this one tomorrow to show any friends or rewatch the moment, ask questions, uh, feel free to ask questions on the YouTube video. Like, hey, at 42 minutes, there was this kind of fish. What is that? And we'll try to answer some questions that we missed while we were underwater. And pretty soon, you guys are all going to be able to ask these questions in our Discord. We're getting that up and running right now. So yeah. get ready. All right. I've definitely said bye like 10 yes. times. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm trying to that. answer questions for you. Um, and that is a weird light angle. Don't do that. Sorry. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> I'm like, don't do that. It looks so scary. Um, can I be brave and ask if you're going to use travel agent for May? Rasta, no, no, you're fine. Uh, I don't think so. I've never used a travel agent before. Um, our biggest thing is like, we are going to be traveling and switching countries very often. I think we're probably going to be going to three to six different countries per year from here on out. Um, so we have a lot going on and we're going to be homeschooling our kids and live streaming our dives and also working from home on our various projects and everything. So we have a lot going on. All the gifts and everything, you guys getting us in the rankings helps a lot. Um, it really does. It helps us like pay for all of this gear, you guys, uh, especially this live streaming gear gets pretty pricey. So you guys are incredible. But on top of it, you're putting us in a position little by little to where we're working a little bit less um, and being able to spend more time with you guys. I mean, like I said, if we aren't actively working, we're live streaming. Lance has been up since six o'clock this morning and I, I don't think he's sat down all day between diving and going into his real job. Like, oh my God, I know. I'm so sorry, Roxanne, but we do have to go. I, we're tired. We have a long, 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 long ride back. Um, I would sit here and answer questions with you guys all night. I really would, but <laughs> we have about an hour drive um, and we have no service on the drive <laughs> and then we've got to clean gear and go to sleep. 
But we will be back tomorrow, you guys. Good night, good night. Good night. Good night. Um, I don't wanna, it looks weird when you hold it above your head. Oh God. Lance, that is like the worst lighting you could do. Well, it design, like, we'll do makes like... me look like a scared Lance, you're not allowed to do that. <laughs> good night, good night. We'll drive super carefully, you guys. Um, I will make an event for tomorrow so you guys can check up what time we're gonna be live and then always just kind of check up on our Instagram. We try to post a lot oh, on there nice. and update you guys. So <laughs> but bye bye guys. Bye bye. We'll see you tomorrow. We love you guys so, 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 so much. And I can't wait to go rewatch this whole live over and over and over again. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>